I had a miscarriage with my first pregnancy and I um, had incompetent cervix so I had to get a cerclage and I was a high risk pregnancy because of that and then also because of advanced maternal age which I don't think 35 is but <laughs> for pregnancy reasons it is. You know with any woman that's either advanced age or has other complications with a previous pregnancy it's a happy time, but it's also a very nervous time. And so if your physician is there with you and reassuring you, that just makes all the difference in the world. What is unique in the Southeast about UAB is that it provides this array of subspecialists and their supporting technologies 24 seven that's immediately available to provide this care uh, to a patient or to a baby who needs it. This involves not just the physicians, but it involves a significant component from the nursing team. It involves uh, technologists to provide supportive care for these patients. It involves anesthesiology teams. When an acute emergency occurs, even if it's unanticipated, we can bring together that multidisciplinary team uh, immediately and bring it to the patient to provide the sophisticated care that they may require. We have a new facility opening in 2010. We're very excited about that and the opportunities that it will bring to us in, on many fronts as it allows us to efficiently consolidate all of the care in a core facility in one place and it makes it easier for us and it makes it easier uh, for the patients. Often seconds do matter in the outcome both for the mother and for the baby. This new facility offers an integrated approach to care where the intensive care unit and the obstetrical unit are just next to each other on the same floor and the operating rooms that we will have are just around the corner. And one of the advantages of us being a major research center, as we are, particularly in obstetrics and in neonatology, is that when new opportunities come along to insert advances into clinical care, we're already on the cutting edge and can introduce those into our clinical care right away. For example, in the last year, we've introduced uh, two new important interventions that will improve the outcome of pregnancies on the heels of two studies that we participated in doing and that we published. I felt like we were in the best hands possible when we had them because there were so many people there that, um, that truly helped us through the situation. They were, they were great and they were very professional and um, it was a great relationship. Thank you so much, and here's Ryan. <laughs> um, thanks for helping him to get here because it was, uh, it was definitely tough, but um, just the reassurance that they gave me before he was born, during my hospitalization, after he was born was phenomenal. Because it was a wonderful experience. Um, I have nothing but positive things to say. My position on down to the nursing staff, and it was wonderful. I mean, everybody who was involved was wonderful.